Good evening, everyone, or good morning, whatever the case may be, and welcome, brothers and sisters. I was going to title this video, I tried to get it done earlier in the day, Breaking Christian News and Prophecy for July the 6th, 2016, but now it's 1.34 a.m., and that's Eastern Standard Time, and sleep, or past your day, and it just does not come. It's very difficult to... Today now it is July the 7th, 2016, and uh, very difficult to unwind after a, a long and trying day that I had today with the ministry. Try not to talk too loud uh, because the whole house is asleep, but uh, it's very difficult when you lay your head on that pillow and you close your eyes and you recall and you see the faces of uh, so many people that are hurting, but uh, you know that uh, your best just doesn't cut it. Your best just isn't good enough. But I was going to come on, and uh, I've got a video already recorded that I did earlier this afternoon, but there's a lot of distraction, and uh, I couldn't get this video out earlier. It's been a trying day. I was going to talk about Hillary Clinton and her no uh, uh, indictment and uh, how she is above the law and the FBI director Comey and uh, he refused to answer any questions from the press but he's going to be drilled tomorrow. I'm going to try to cover that if I can, if I can find the time, by the uh, Senate uh, Judiciary Committee, I believe is what you call it, and uh, they want uh, some questions. She put this country in great jeopardy. But uh, I did a video the other day where the homeless people were being attacked by this one individual with a club. Uh, he was beating them with this uh, club-like object. And uh, the attacks continue in uh, San Diego, and this began on Sunday, when uh, I want to share this with all of you. The attack on the homeless is increasing. We're living in the end days, and I uh, just want to show you how uh, the homeless are being treated. I just want to share this with you. Let me take you to the video that uh, I recorded earlier, and uh, at the time, uh, it was a breaking story. It was just a few hours, uh, a few hours in. The homeless are being beaten, the homeless are being set on fire, and being slaughtered in the streets. Let me share this with all of you. All right, now this story came out just a few hours ago, uh, July the 6th, 2016. San Diego on alert after violent attacks on homeless. A series of attacks on homeless people in San Diego have left two people dead and two hospitalized. The most recent attacks happened Wednesday morning, this morning, when police found a man with significant injuries to his upper torso at 5.10 a.m. reported KNSD-TV. Captain David Nislet uh, told KNSD-TV that the victim was set on fire, but a witness removed a burning towel from the victim before police arrived, which saved and from suffering more burns, the victim was transported to a nearby hospital. Police believe Wednesday's attack, today's attack, was related to attacks earlier in the week. Angelo DiNardo's body was found burning in the Bay Park area Sunday morning. An autopsy revealed that DiNardo suffered severe trauma to the upper torso and died before being set on fire, reported the San Diego Union Tribune, USA Today. Witnesses told police they saw a white man in his 40s or 50s running away from the burning body with a gas can, according to KSWB-TV. Two more attacks were reported early Monday morning. Police found a man injured in San Diego's Midway area. He was hospitalized with the severe trauma to his torso, and another man was found dead in Ocean Beach a few hours later. He also suffered trauma to the torso. San Diego police released a statement Tuesday describing the first three attacks with pictures and a surveillance video from a 
convenience store, but identifies a person of interest, a man wearing a baseball cap, jacket, and backpack. If you're from the San Diego area and you're viewing this video, please take a look at this. There's no sound, but uh, this is the uh, person in question that may be the one uh, doing the attacks. And this is from a convenience store uh, surveillance camera. Oh my goodness. San, uh, San Diego, rather, police department needs your help to identify and uh, locate the sus suspects responsible for two homicides and a violent attack. I apologize, it's a little difficult for me. The attacks have scared the homeless people in uh, San Diego, prompting uh, many of them to sleep in groups, according to San Diego Union Tribune. Though some are still unfazed due to the commonality of violence against the homeless in the area, and I see this in Flint, uh, with uh, the death, uh, the beating death of a homeless gentleman in uh, Flint, Michigan, that we minister to, Robert Nagy, and uh, a group of uh, thugs found him sleeping in a garbage dumpster, and it was uh, around midnight, and when he was beaten, beaten to death. We'll be right back. Very heartbreaking, very heartbreaking, and uh, very difficult to, uh, for Pastor Dave. And uh, I'm going to have a special uh, video in the morning that I'm going to put out. Uh, like I said, no, now it's 1:37 a.m. and uh, very difficult to unwind. There is not a lot of sleep, and we'll pray for your pastor. Pray for pastors that are going out and in, into the war zones and into the fields. Stay tuned in the morning for a, a special video. Good night. I love you all. Sleep well. Rest in Jesus.